Poirier versus Michael Chandler absolutely delivered. It did. I mean, you wondered aloud if this fight could be everything we thought it would be. It wasn't more. I mean, Chandler fought a really good first round. Then Dustin disposes of his nose at the end of round one. It, I mean, the blood just splattered when he hit him with the left hand. Round two, Chandler comes out and takes him down, but expends a ton of energy holding Dustin Poirier down, which ultimately I believe was his demise. Because in round three, we never see Michael Chandler tired, but he was tired. And Dustin Poirier said, very surely, who doesn't have any jujitsu? That was the Islam Akashev. He was yelled at from the octagon. Who don't have no jujitsu? Because he went out there and he submitted Michael Chandler in round three. There were a lot of people in text messages and groups that I had that were saying Dustin's gonna knock him out in round three. He did, he submitted him. But it's that fighter spirit that Dustin Poirier possesses that allows him to never be out of a fight.